My name is Andrew Yeo and I'm a pastor from Singapore. Psalms 130 verse 5 says this, I will wait for the Lord. My whole being waits and in His word I put my hope. How long have you been waiting on God? Days, months, years? Are you about to give up hope? Wondering if God will ever answer your prayer. Be encouraged, my friend. Put your hope in Christ Jesus. No one likes to wait. We want everything instantly. Instant food, instant entertainment, and instant Wi-Fi connection. But yet, life is full of waiting. We have the mindset of, I want it now. Psalm 130 has a simple yet profound message for us today. Those who wait on the Lord, wait in hope. We don't wait in desperation or despair. We wait on the Lord and put our trust in Him and in His promises. Eight years ago, I woke up and found that I had completely lost my vision. I was rushed to the hospital and was told that I needed to go for an emergency eye operation or risk going blind. After the surgery, I still couldn't see. Day after day, the feeling of waking up and not being able to see was completely, really discouraging. I fell into depression and I started to doubt. Did God really hear my prayer? Questions of what if came to my mind. What if I can't see again? What if my eyes are not healed? And each time I felt discouraged, I would listen to his word through the audio Bible on my version app. Something was happening even when it seems like nothing was happening. God used the waiting to change me. He taught me to wait and to put my trust in him for my healing. My only cry to God then was, all I want to do, Lord, is to read the Bible with my own eyes. The miracle came and the next day when I woke up, my vision was completely restored, healed within a month. There are many people in the Bible that waited for the fulfillment of God's promises. Abraham and Sarah waited for 25 years. Joseph, 13 years. Moses waited and even Jesus himself waited. It takes time for the roots of a tree to grow. To grow deep enough to support and nourish the tree, producing that promised fruit. So put your hope in his word. Allow your roots to go deep as you wait on him because your breakthrough is coming.